Okay, folks, so quick video. This is Stealth Guy Game coming at you once again. Um, seeing a topic that came up, and sorry for the noise. Uh, the site that I'm working at today has a loud background. But there's a rumor going around that PS Plus might get integrated with PS Now. And honestly, it ain't for me if they do it. Now, if they have it separated, cool whatever that's cool for people that want ps now ps plus get it me being a person that beta tested it and used it off and on throughout the years it has nothing for me particularly uh the only reason i say that is because i buy just about every game that comes out that i can think of like i literally if a game comes out i buy it it's not too many that slip through the cracks. PS Plus usually picks up the ones that slip through the crack for me. So therefore, me having PS Now really does nothing because I don't go back and play PS3 games. I don't go back and play PS2 games like that even though I own some of my PS4. It's just like not really a thing for me if you get my drill. Um... And if they integrate PS1 games again, I don't go back and play PS3 or PS2, so what makes them come and play PS1? Just saying. Now we have another thing where people are making an issue out of Sony's manufacturing process on the chips inside the consoles. And here's a little secret. Every company that relies on silicon production or chip production has these issues. You can project, sorry, I got something in my head. Oh, uh, you can project to have this many. <laughs> and the silicon just like, nah, player, we ain't doing that. Oh, uh, and basically what I'm saying, because NVIDIA is a prime example, because they do this all the time, they only take out of their manufacturing process they only take a certain percentage that they want to set aside to be their top tier um, chips like for their kingpin well like EVGA will out you know have to be able with other companies to get the top bin cards out of those production lines so you'll have like the highest tier then you'll have like this middle tier and then you have this low tier so, pretty much all the chips that get used in some form, unless they're just totally under what they want. But more than likely, you have these same disparities within GPUs. Now, with consoles, you have to make sure everything runs at a particular rate. So, of course, if something goes wrong and it's not up to this particular spec, they're not going to put in a console, which is a good thing. Because that means they're actually paying attention to what's coming outside the factory so they can... What is... Oh. I knew I had something in my head. I kept looking at the camera. I'm like, what is that on my face? Um, so, yeah. It's, to me, not an issue. I don't even know why people are bringing it up. But, you know, it made news. So, people got to bring it up because it's something that could potentially give us the one-up on the PlayStation ain't like y'all ain't been getting your ass with all gin already so but yeah just quick video that's all i really want to talk about because i'm not going to get into the whole influencer talk i'm i'm tired of talking about influencers it's nothing to me um but yeah this stuff got gaming and i'm gonna eat my breakfast because i ain't ate breakfast yet and i've been up since four this morning yeah, so I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.